last skater to go. The last of 35 drawn from 27 countries is the champion of Europe, Peter Barna from Czechoslovakia. Bronze medalist in the Olympic Games following his European success in Lausanne. Tremendous height on the triple-triple combination. Triple Lutz followed by the Triple Tolu. And he carries on from there. straight step sequence. Impressive program. Nice circular steps now. best roar of the whole proceedings and if the crowd had their way he will finish ahead of Petrenko and Browning who now lead they're followed by uh, Stoiko, Bowman, Eldridge and Ermanov in that order but this fellow could pass them all a deserved reception I think too because he skated really well the combination there going into the triple lots followed by the triple toe loop really the only man competitor to do the triple triple um, the difficult triple lots triple toe loop whereas Petrenko and Browning were doing the triple axle but they only followed that up by a double toe loop so it's going to be interesting how the judges mark this of what they give precedence what I like about Bonner's program that it seemed to be a complete one that the music followed all the way through the sequence of steps were nicely put together in particular I liked his step sequences they were very intricate and very difficult and uh, he, he paid a lot of attention to the actual structure of it well the roar from the crowd tells the story two 5.9s Three 5.8s, couple of 5.7s, two 5.6s. Those are the marks for required elements. And he gets a six. He gets a six from the German judge. And a whole posse of 5.9s. And a couple of 5.8s. And for all the six and the 5.9s and the appreciation of the crowd, Barna is in second place behind Viktor Petrenko, but ahead of the defending world champion, Kurt Browning.
So just to confirm that, Viktor Petrenko, the Olympic champion, leads after the original programme from European champion Petr Barna and Canada's Kurt Browning, who's won this title for the last three years. Britain's Stephen Cousins is lying 21st. And you'll be able to see the conclusion of the men's programme tomorrow on Grandstand. We're back with the pairs programme in just a moment.